good evening here is father denny today is the 14th sunday of ordinary time and today's gospel passage is from gospel of mark chapter 6 verse 1 to 6 in this gospel passage we see jesus he went to his hometown and he started to teach in the synagogue but the people in the synagogue were not ready to accept his teaching and they find reason not to accept his teaching and they told is he a carpenter is he not a carpenter he is the son of mary and we know his brothers so they came to a conclusion that jesus is one among them they couldn't find the divinity of jesus and we know that and the purpose of jesus birth into the world is to save the world so when he started to preach to the people his intention was to save their soul but they were not ready to accept him his teaching they were not ready to open their life for him to receive his teaching so what is the relevance of this gospel in our life the same situation can be happen in our life so there will be two situation we fail to receive the grace of god we fail to receive the salvation the first case the first situation we can find the people in this situation there are people in the world who says that we don't need god we don't need the sacraments we don't need the faith because we are sufficient and we could live in this world we have everything the second situation sometimes we also in the second situation there will be a moment or oh, now we are going to the same situation we say that oh i am a sinner i am always fail i fail in my thoughts i fail in my action i fail to forgive with my friends my parents my siblings i judge others i say the lie so i am not worthy to receive the grace of god i am not worthy to stand before god but for this situation we have a answer from today's second reading where we see saint paul and he prayed three times and in the beginning he is telling that god has given him a throne in the flesh and he is praying please take away this throne from me he prayed three times to take away that means he prayed three times to take away his weakness but god told him my grace is sufficient for you So today's gospel passage today's readings of this Sunday is giving a hope for us your weakness your failures and your sins is those are an occasion to receive the grace those are an opportunity to come Jesus and receive the salvation because Jesus came to this world to embrace the weak people so we are fortunate to be with him so let us open our hearts let us open up the doors of our family for Jesus he wants to get in let him get into our life we can go with him and we can have the salvation so don't worry about your weakness don't worry about your past life don't worry what is happening now you are a great sinner and you have committed so many sins in your life still you are in sins but for god he knows everything he's told to paul i know everything let your weakness be there be please come to me the same god is telling you let your weakness is there come with your failures come with your weakness i am ready to receive you i am ready to embrace you and i want to be with you and i want you to be saved so let us have the salvation 
try to save our soul be with jesus this is a blessing for to them your almighty god bless you the father and the son and the holy spirit amen pray for me god bless thank you